Good morning, Tar Heel fans. Hopefully, you're all having a, uh, a much better morning this morning uh, after last night's or yesterday's uh, debacle. Man, I've had a lot of t- uh, a time to think about what happened and everything. And man, all I got to say is number one, getting up this morning, heading to church right now. All I can say is, you know what? No matter what, we're gonna rep. The, we're gonna rep the Carolina Blue, baby. We're gonna rep that Carolina Blue. We're gonna. We're going to wear it proudly. No matter what happens, we're going to wear it proudly. That's number one. Number two, we got a lot to talk about this week. And uh, I'm going to be jumping on videos today. And uh, this is going to be a full slate this week. A full slate of uh, Mac Brown's presser, the five takes. That's going to be coming, or key takes. That's going to be coming back uh, this week. And we missed last week. But uh, we're definitely going to hit it this week. It's going to be a big one. And um, we got Duke to look forward to. Or we've got we got that we're doing that tonight as well. So there's gonna be a lot of things to be going on this week for Carolina football. And I just want to quickly take this time right now to, to say this: starting today, the next 48 to 72 hours are the most pivotal in Carolina's history. Um, what we're seeing right now in year six of Mac Brown is something that is I almost want to say unprecedented but we've seen this before with Larry Fedora uh, but never under the tutelage and the leadership of a Hall of Fame head coach we've never saw this before ever in this time you know with with, with, with these stakes with this coach we've never saw this and what happens right now matters because you're three and one. Now, nah, don't get me wrong. That one is the ugliest one we have ever saw, right? But you were in position to win that game. And if you tweak a few things, you win that game. It's a extremely ugly win, and we're mad that it was that ugly, but at least you won. And you have some things you can fix going forward. But Going into ACC play, you're zero and zero. That nothing else to it, you know. You're you're zero and zero. So, take advantage of this moment right now, and how Carolina responds is going to be key. Because I tell you, if they go into Duke and they get beat bad, get ready. You might not win another game because. In my opinion, the ACC is looking better than originally thought. Duke wasn't supposed to look as, you know, as quality as they are. Pittsburgh was not supposed to look as quality as they are. We've saw Boston College. We've saw what Georgia Tech can be. They're going to be serviceable, man. It's going to be big. So we got to get in there and we got to get after it. And that's all we can do. I just want to quickly say that. Get ready for a full week this week. Thank you. Go Eagles.